is really impressive, Andrew. What are we looking at here today? This is Alan Bradley, Rockwell Automation's Centerline 2100 Series Motor Control Center. What does it do? So, the Motor Control Center allows us to highly pack uh, motor control equipment in a small footprint to allow for ease of installation and maintenance. So, what is the um, reasoning for this design? This design encompasses network control and communication in all the devices and allows us to do things like remote metering, and there is also some additional safety features that are built in to the motor control center that's behind us here. What kind of cabling can be run through here? Back in the past, it has been device net, as that was the standard. Uh, in the last five or six years, as uh, Ethernet IP has taken hold in industry, uh, we see about 90% of the motor control centers now being pre-wired and pre-configured for Ethernet. What's the benefit of running Ethernet? Uh, there's multiple benefits to Ethernet. Uh, one of them would be you're saving on labor uh, from a conduit and wire standpoint. Also, the average cost per I.O. point for something that's hardwired is about $50 to $60. And we can encompass some um, basically everything here on one Ethernet cable. Is there a space saving benefits with using a motor control center? Rockwell Automation is the only motor control center manufacturer that offers a centerline bus design, meaning that we have a higher power density, more current and horsepower per foot, uh, and we also have options like a NEMA space saving type of starter here that allows us to pack uh, more buckets like that into one section. Andrew, how is safety incorporated while using a motor control center? There's a number of safety options that we can add directly at the factory, one of them being the yellow door down here that allows people to very quickly distinguish where the main disconnecting means is. There's also other options such as their arc shield design, which incorporates the spring-loaded spring latches. IR viewing windows, which allow the uh, scanner to remain um, in front of the motor control center with the door closed, so they don't necessarily have to fully suit up to take their readings. Also, uh, Rockwell's patented Secure Connect, which I have a demo of right here, uh, allows them to remove power from the motor control center with the door closed, which is one of the biggest safety concerns is removal and mounting of the MCC unit. So Rockwell's patented Secure Connect technology allows you to slide a motor control center bucket into the structure with the stabs enclosed and with a simple quarter inch uh, hex key or socket adapter, allow for a quick quarter turn to allow the stabs to come out of the enclosure and onto the vertical bus. Like, likewise, when we want to remove the bucket, that same quarter turn secures those stabs back inside their enclosure, and you can be certain that power has been removed from the inside of the bucket. If someone was looking to get more information on motor control centers, who could they contact? They could contact myself or any of their local Warner Electric account managers.